Hey guys, Tonic here, another Tuesday, another Atomic Shop review. This week in the Atomic Shop, we just got the Blue Ridge Bundle, as well as a brand new Log Cabin Porch Set. I just picked both of them up, so let's go check them out. First off, let's take a look at the brand new Blue Ridge Power Armor paint. Now, this is one of those paints that will actually change based on the type of power armor that you are using. It's not one of those universal skins, and I really like it for that reason. Now, I only have two pieces of power armor that I can actually put this on because I'm not much of a power armor user, but I did test a lot of them. It does work on T65. However, it does not work on Hellcat or Raider power armor. Next up in this bundle, we have an outfit called the Blue Ridge Trading Outfit, and right away some older Fallout players might notice this as the Roving Trader Outfit from Fallout 3 in New Vegas. Super cool that they brought this outfit back, and it honestly makes me like it a lot more. But putting my nostalgia aside for this outfit, there's not really anything too flashy or eye-catching about this outfit, and there's not even any Blue Ridge Caravan logos on it, so for newer fans of the series, they might not really like this outfit too much. The next item in this bundle is a Blue Ridge skin for the Lever Action Rifle, and I honestly really like this one a lot as well. You have a nice logo there on the stock and some very nice blue coloring along the woodwork. Now here's what this weapon looks like with the skin attached while using it in first person. And really quick before I show off the brand new porch, I do kind of want to give a quick PSA. Right here, the log cabin kit, I already own the walls and it's selling for 350 atoms, but then right down here, the porch set is selling for 500. So I can buy the porches for 350 atoms, or I can go down here and buy them for 500. Definitely, if you already do own the walls, go here and buy them because it's saving you about 150 atoms. So here I'm just going to build a very small cabin using all the brand new things. So we'll build that and then we will also go and build a little porch and I'll build some walls around it. So here we have it, it's kind of a really weird structure but I just wanted to use almost every piece in the bundle. So right here we do have these really nice wood railings that it does come with, they are called the Log Cabin Porch Railing. Super cool because we only used to have the contemporary ones. Then going over here, the Log Cabin Kit will of course come with the walls which come with these nice windows, a door and then just some normal walls and some roof pieces. Now interestingly enough, you cannot place any wallpaper on these walls so do consider that when you are thinking about purchasing them. But other than that, I mean, it's an awesome wall set and I really do enjoy building with it. And as far as the brand new porches go, I love how they have the green roof. I also love the railing system, but most importantly, I think my favorite part is the foundation of it. Now, with the contemporary porches, the ones that we had a while ago, the bottom was like this see-through kind of netting and you would always be able to see the ground underneath and if there were maybe bushes or rocks or even ore under there, you'd always be able to see it. But with these brand new ones, they are completely solid just a ton of logs there and I really do like that and it does actually go up pretty far as well so if we're to take this we can have a ton of them and we can also put it flush with the ground super cool and I'm really excited to use this in future builds and so at this point in the video I like to go through the entire atomic shop for those that work and it's kind of got on right now to see everything so on the front page we have all of the new stuff as well as some lunch boxes and repair kits over here we have the stuff from last week over in Greatest Hits, we have the Mothman Outfit Bundle, as well as the Deep Cave Hunter stuff. I do have a video up on the Deep Cave Hunter Bundle, super cool bundle if you are interested in that. Then over in Vaulting, we have the Wavy Willard's Wipeout Bundle. And over in Special, we have the Let's Hunt emote, which I thought was kind of interesting that they brought that back. I think that was old around Easter time. I really like this emote. I do actually use it a lot, so that is super cool that that is back, and I think it's free as well. Then over here, we have some 250 caps. We also have the giant letters and the Fallout First Crocodile statue, and we also do have the Coal Dust paint for the Excavator Power Armor. And really quickly before I give my final thoughts and review of this week's Atomic Shop, I do want to apologize for my voice and if I sound kind of monotone today. I work outside in construction and this time of year up north the weather is wild. Some days it's super hot and some days it's super cold and some days it's both. So my allergies are absolutely destroying me today. My throat is super raw, my nose is super stuffy, but I'm powering through it to get this Atomic Shop review done so I'm super sorry about my voice. But now on to my final thoughts on this week's Atomic Shop. It's actually really good. I love the Blue Ridge Caravan as a faction in the game however i do kind of wish that the power armor worked on all types of power armor specifically with the brand new hellcat power armor i really do think that that does need some dedicated skins and it would have been really nice to kind of start it off with this blue ridge skin for it but that's not really too big of an issue because the skin itself is very nice on other armors and 
not everybody really uses the Hellcat power armor. But as far as the lever action skin and the outfit goes, those are actually very nice. I will say that the bundle is a little bit expensive, but when you do look at all of the prices of the individual items, it kind of does make sense. And if you are a very big Blue Ridge fan, these items may be worth it to you. But if you're not, it is a very expensive bundle and you could get a lot more with your items going for something else. Like the log cabin kit that they just did add. That log cabin kit I really do think is a cool idea to throw the porch and the walls together. That being said, I do think that price difference is kind of weird where if you already own the walls, you can pay two different prices for the porches. You can pay 500 atoms if you get them alone, or if you go through the bundle page, you pay 350 atoms. I think that little discrepancy in the price is very strange, and I really do feel bad for those people that did buy it and lost a few atoms just for not knowing that you could go through the bundle and get it for cheaper but just looking at the bundle for what it is it is actually pretty decent as far as all the other stuff in the shop goes there are some very nice items back and still some very nice items in the shop that you can grab before they go so overall i do think it's a very good week in the atomic shop and i honestly am pretty stoked to see what comes next week but that is pretty much going to be it for this video, so I do want to give a massive thank you to everybody who stopped by and watched, and as always, a massive thank you to all the channel members, Robert Kennard, Death 93 Joshua Graham, Lanthar, Anna Reestes, Fallout McFly, Captain Awesome, Citizen Girl, Chad of Fallout 76 Podcast, Heather Henderson, Yozevated, Patrick Ruda, 23 Icefire, Jay Smith, Argent Deer, Browse the Double Frank, Ice Cream Manny, Chris Decker, Theodore, Digital Aardvark, Lone Samurai OG, DFN Gaming, Christy Mellon Schwitz, you guys are amazing, I love you guys, and have a great day.